Hola. Thank you everyone for voting me to the final round. I'm so happy and proud to be here. For the final challenge, OPI wants us to create a mural on five nail tips. My inspiration for this channel is the new Spring Mexico City collection. I love this collection because I used to live in Mexico. Mexico, their people, their culture, and especially their food will always have a special place in my heart. Frida Kahlo, Moctezuma, the Aztec King, and Emiliano Zapata are some of the most important personalities in Mexico history, and I want to make a tribute to them in my mural. Create my mural using only the OPI Spring Mexico City collection. These gel colors are so perfect that you don't need anything else. Glue the tips together and polish a coat of Alpine Snow. Add clear powder perfection on top and cure for 60 seconds to create some texture. I want a watercolor effect as a base of my mural. I add the 12 gel colors on top and tap them with alcohol to blend them together. For murals, you always start from the center to the sides to give proportion and balance to your piece. Starting with Moctezuma, paint his face in Verde Nice to Meet You to make it look like Jade. Paint the jaguar mask on his head with Don't Tell a Soul and mix this yellow with My Chihuahua Doesn't Bite Anymore for the brown spots. I'm doing tie-dye technique for his horns. Add lines in horizontal position and move them with a brush in opposite way. For a cool acrylic paint technique, swipe the colors in different directions with a fan brush and with a toothbrush, spring different colors over. In a world where art was dominated for men, Frida Kahlo gave us hope and show us that girls can conquer the top of this world. Painting my monarch butterfly in an ombre technique, blending different colors. Don't tell a soul, my chihuahua doesn't bite anymore, and coralling your spirit animal. Emiliano Zapata was the leading figure in Mexican Revolution, giving hope to the working class for equal treatment. For the skin color mix, don't tell a soul, tell a me about it, and who is the artist? Mixing the blue, yellow, orange, and red, we are gonna create three different browns to paint the eagle on the Mexican flag. With Verde Nice to Meet You, paint the snake. Then mix Don't Tell a Soul and Mi Casa is Blue Casa to create the green on top. Mixing Mariachi makes my day and Don't Tell a Soul. I create a brown to represent the glory of the Tehuacan pyramids. With the color Mi Casa is Blue Casa, I'm representing the modern Mexico City. The colonial era and the most iconic buildings in Mexico City, like Angel de la Independencia and Bellas Artes Palace, will be represented in different colors to make them pop. Día de los Muertos is probably one of the biggest celebrations in Mexico, giving us hope that one day we will all be together with our loved ones. I'm representing this day with their traditional skull and decorating the head with flowers in different colors. With dotting technique, I'm adding traditional guirnaldas or perforated paper that are very popular during the holidays. I love alebrijes. They are brightly colored Mexican folk art sculptures of mystical animals and very popular in Mexico. You cannot go wrong with these animals. Paint them in any shape and bright colors and add as many details as you can. I use eight different techniques to paint my mural using the 12 colors from OPI Spring Mexico City Collection. 
I really hope you love my mural. Thank you, OPI and Nails Magazine, for this opportunity. Besos and pura vida.